Welcome to Blitz RC everyone today. Just a quick update of what I've got going on at the bench at the moment. This is uh, one of my first ever remote control cars. Probably got that when I was about eight. I'm 46 years old now, so that's probably 38 years old. Um, and I got myself a new project because I couldn't help myself. Even though I've got about seven or 10 projects on the go, I've got the Midnight Pumpkin got the metallic one wasn't sure about that um, but the problem I've got at the moment is I've got that many cars I've got to paint so I'm not really too concerned because at least I won't have to paint this one so here we go nice to me a boxing as always um, makes you bring bring you back to being a kid when you open up one of these even though I never got one when I was a kid so there's the body there um, Looks fantastic, gonna have to be careful with that I guess so. Um, depending on where I want to go with this, if I want it to be a shelf clean, I don't really want to go scratching that up. Um, I guess you've got a box of motor, gears and all those sorts of things to be in there. Um, there's more chrome parts here, um, the front grill, things like that. Um, yeah, most of the other parts for your chassis, windows, um, got your wheel parts down here, got to do the, uh, oh they feel nice and supple, had to do the obligatory wheel smell, and um, thought they'd be a bit bigger, uh, I guess they are bigger, needs to be worn down a bit though, but they're about the same size really. Maybe once I get a wheel on them, they'll come out a little bit bigger. Yeah, so I'm going to get stuck into that tonight. Um, still got, like I said, other projects to, to get done. Got the ground hall sitting over here. Um, got a lot of the sound effects working. Programmed in the Fly Sky controller. Um, so really getting there now. Just need to paint. Um, and a few more of the electronics, lights and everything obviously in the cab because I won't be able to do that until I paint it but um, that's looking good and then I've got my golf sitting over here need to take that out for another drive a lot of fun driving front wheel drive car never had one before in my life um, and yeah, got the sand scorcher sitting there I've cleaned up the body, sort of ready for paint um, and yeah, the tip rack sitting down here so that's had a bit of a bingo at the front I think I might know why someone's thrown it out at the tip it's got some problems with the front end that I'll talk about maybe in another video do another video about that haven't taken the Hoonigan out for a while um, really need to need to clean maybe put some of the actual stickers on it um, always hold off with those sort of things just because don't want them to get messed up um, when I'm driving them. So sometimes I might decide that, you know, about time that it goes up my shelf for a while and maybe only drive it here and there and be a bit more careful. But I always just like to get them out and have a bit of fun with them. So yeah, um, fixed up that one um, just yesterday. Just had a screw come out. It's the only thing I've had come wrong with that, just in the front wheel. Um, one of the screws kept coming out. Um, so yeah and, and i've been driving that thing really hard so yeah definitely got to get that out again um so yeah that's about it so thanks for watching um like share subscribe nice almost winter afternoon autumn still all the leaves to clean up at the front getting a bit chilly so yeah like i said like share subscribe thanks for watching blitz rc take care all